It's Jerry Murray of Murray Associates, uh, award-winning accountants. If somebody asked me once, uh, wh why do we enter awards? Uh, well, <laughs> the best way of explaining is that um, we didn't enter awards uh, when we first joined AVN back in 2006 uh, because we felt we weren't worthy. But uh, within five years, I uh, went through all the training programs I had and realized actually um, we were developed to the point where I was thinking, hang on here, we're good enough to be recognized to, to achieve those awards. And we first became a finalist back in 2011. We didn't win then, we didn't expect to win, but what it made, made us think that because we got short listed and in part of being one of the finalists, we A, we felt special and thought, well, yeah, we're getting somewhere here. So uh, we were patting ourselves back, uh, on the back at the time, but we, we, we couldn't get there in terms of winning the award. But by actually entering those awards, we found out, hang on here, it helps us improve our own systems uh, and how uh, the team worked well together. Uh, over a period of time, we kept becoming finalists and finalists and eventually we won an award with the 2020 group uh, uh, back in uh, 2014. Uh, Gloria was the, the most innovative accountant uh, um, in, in the UK. Now, from that, it even boosted our confidence even more, saying, okay, well, if we've won that award, the AVN award is one of the ones that Gloria's always want to win as well, because we've got so much from those guys that uh, it's probably, probably the best trade in the UK, definitely. And um, we, we eventually won the award in 2017. So we had to earn the right to stand on the stage and, and, and receive an award, which was one of the most fantastic awards we've ever had. It was, we won the Changing Lives, Lives Award uh, because we're helping the clients uh, become more and more successful. Now, the great thing is about entering the awards, you can actually publicize the fact that uh, you are actually achieving stuff um, and you're also sharing what you're doing with everybody else that's in your profession. Now, by doing that, it helps them get better. It helps them provide a better service than anybody else is giving, just by a member of the AVN the group themselves. Um, and you always get tips from them. Because you do forget things. You think, oh yeah, that's a great idea. I can use that one, because I'm doing it. But then you find out how well they do it, and you're thinking, yeah, I can do that as well. So you're constantly achieving, and constantly uh, performing to the highest level uh, around the UK, in fact, the world, because you, you've got to admit the UK is a pretty tough market at the end of the day. Uh, we've all got the same challenge, so let's help each other by doing that. So I would even say to anybody that in any profession, any sector, enter awards, because you'll always learn something in the fact that you can actually pat yourself and the team on the back, get some publicity, and the majority is free, and you can actually tell people in the media, even if it's just a local newspaper, you get exposure, which will help you know the local clients come on board and refer you even more. And the great thing is, um, by entering the wards, one of the criteria that we use in the UK, well, we've got to tell them, give them the evidence that you know we are good. We just ask the clients for testimonials. We get testimonials straight away, and they're just glowing so much, it's practically embarrassing with some of them. Me, I like it because I do the marketing bit. So I would encourage anybody to enter the wards, mix with the, the, the fellow accountants that are in there, particularly in the AVN group, because they are you know, the, some of the top, top accountants in the whole of the UK, and you will learn so much more. But the great thing is you get yourself out and about, meet other people and have some fun. I mean, we, we, when we first entered the wards back in 2011, uh, we didn't think you know, we'd end up as a, as a finalist, but we were. I thought, oh, bloody hell, you know, we're getting somewhere here. But it was, I think it was a little bit beyond that. Somebody's independently looking at, looking at you, and then you realise what you're doing is good. And then when you, you realise what other people are doing and you, <laughs> and you didn't put it in the application form, that starts getting annoying. Now, the thing by doing that, because you're improving yourself, improving the application even, plus you're learning other stuff and getting uh, your, your quali the quality of the work and level of service you, you're entering is getting higher and higher and higher, which means one day you will rise to the top. And we managed to do that in 2017 for the, you know, the, the, the two, two best uh, accountancy groups in the UK, which were 2020 in AVN. But the one that Gloria re was really wanting, because she already won the, the, the 2020 award in 2014, was the AVN one, and this year she did it. She's ever so pleased. Even by going through that process of writing what you're doing, you can actually use it in all the marketing materials. So you have somebody that specialises in marketing. Get them to do it. Don't you do it. Get them to do it. Then you look over it. Let them interview even, because I go back to Gloria and say, okay, what do you do for the clients this year? I know you said something about so-and-so, and, -so and the, you know you increase the profit by you know, you know thousands of pounds. Can you tell me a little bit more about that? 
Now, by doing that, it comes from a different angle from you seeing it. Um, <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> and the great thing is, um, it becomes part of your script when you send out your marketing material as well. And um, yeah, at the very least, you can use it for your own uh, way of marketing. Plus, um, one of the great things I think we found out is um, you can develop new products and services from it. Uh, because you are giving advice, because one thing that she got to start as a camp, but giving advice straight away. She didn't do the, all the compliance stuff, she did more than that. And then, you know, we've evolved now that we've actually got two streams we've got the county practice and we've got the business growth side of things. So we've actually got two, two things, two products or services, if you like, just from one business. So we're now stopping to separate that so we can generate each to the right level. And the great thing is, <coughs> if, we, if we, the more business growth services we offer, we don't have to be accountancy clients. We'll find that they become accountancy clients because they trust you more. Because you know the numbers, and that's a great thing about the profession. You know your numbers. But you've got to help other people. Otherwise, you know, down the line, with all the making tax digital and all the other stuff that's happening, the automation that everybody's talking about, if you're not offering this, you know, this high level of service to help people understand the numbers, you will miss out because you won't be needed anymore. <coughs>